They're the last of a dying breed. No, not the Shire horses, these wooden beer barrels. They're handmade by craftsmen called coopers. But there are only four of these skilled workers left. It's an ancient trade, and England's last master beer cooper, Alistair Sims, has been making barrels for 30 years. He's the only one qualified to teach an apprentice, a four-and-a-half-year commitment. Both Alistair and his bosses at the Wadworth Brewery are desperate to groom a new cooper. I think we're getting a bit like America, and we want, everybody wants to be a computer whisk kid and not work with their hands. Probably the salary package is not as good, but you get a lot more job satisfaction. But there's another problem. Even though wooden barrels last up to 80 years, they're being nudged out by stainless steel. This may be an uphill battle for the Coopers. The wooden barrels are harder to keep clean than the stainless steel ones. And they're heavier. But for those who know beer, there's more to it. That's more rounded, more complete, more body to it. And it's not just taste. It's heritage as well. It's not just aesthetics, it's heritage. That's what a traditional English pub looks like. Sims never rests. He spends his lunch times checking the product for quality control. And you get a block mark, which is your initials. Every time I put that in a cask, I think, I made that. And it's even better when you go in the pub and you actually look behind the bar and you can see your mark in the cask and you think, and the beer comes out of it and the beer's absolutely wonderful. You think, that's when you, that's when you do feel proud. So it's a job for life that's rich in tradition and a job that lets you sample the product. If that appeals, get your application in to be England's next beer cooper. Amy Gutman, CBS News, Devizes, England.